Hello, my name is Jennifer. Welcome back to another video. Everybody loves furnaces, but what about a super furnace? Hmm? These are only things you will need. You'll need four redstone torches, five hoppers, um, four redstone repeaters. I didn't count how much redstone you need. Forty-five, roughly, hoppers. Not hoppers. Furnaces, four pistons, about five chests, and a tutorial. So, you start by placing 12 chests here in a straight line, and then placing 11 furnaces on top of it. Right. Okay, you will start by placing 10 hoppers. <clears throat> this isn't a hopper. 10, I, f I feel like it's easier doing 10 solid blocks in a line on the ground. 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Place a block, and uh, the 11th block here. Place another block here. Place, one, two. Place another 10 blocks here. And then do the same, so it's like a big square without corners. And so it should be 12 blocks, not including the corners. So. 10 blocks, 10 blocks, 10 blocks, 10 blocks, but without the corners. So like this, 10 blocks, 10 blocks, 10 blocks, 10 blocks. So then you grab your furnace, which is probably the most important thing. And if you put the blocks behind it, you don't have to put the blocks behind it. You can just go straight to furnaces. I find it easier because you don't have to always crouch and use obscene amounts of scaffolding. It's more fun. This can be 10 blocks. And I think it can be shrunk. I don't know how many blocks this smelter smelts a minute. And how many, how fast it takes to smelt a stack of items. All I know, but it's a lot. It's not, it's not that much. Uh, wait, no. Yeah, it's not that much. So you place a piston here. Pointing this way. Place a piston here. Facing up. Place, place a piston here. Facing that way. Place that piston there. So you've got four pistons. Then you grab your repeaters and your glowstone. It's not a glowstone torch. That would be quite cool if we had a glowstone torch. Put so you, you got this. Got a repeater facing into the block that this would push. And it doesn't really matter where you where inside this hole you put it. You can put it here, 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 or here. I don't really care, but it still works. So you grab your redstone and trail it around like that. Simple. And dead chicken. I don't like chickens, very irritating. So, similar to this one, but not similar, but similar, but different. That is what similar means. What? I'm confusing myself. I'm going to stop now. <clears throat> so, you get, grab some glass. You actually only need two pieces of glass in this. Bada, bidi, bidi, bidi. So, and the same over here should be the same as the one below. Bang bang. Place mine these blocks here. Bang bang. Okay, where are those bloomin' slimes? I hate them. The most annoying creature in Minecraft. I just don't like it. Does anybody actually like them? They're despicable. Satanic. No, whatever. And then you grab some hoppers. Up here. Depending on which way the furnace piston is placing, facing, I can't.
can't speak today. Place a hopper here and a hopper here. Put your chest here and here. And then put your, I think you can actually just put it here. Put your thing here. So this is for your smelting stuff, your iron ore. Also, check out the texture I did on the iron ore. I like it. Because look, iron. This is iron, it's white iron. This is also white. And so is. Look, oh, this is also white. But the usual one is orange. Absolutely ridiculous. So down here. Don't think it really matters when you put this. Put. I don't have a chest in the hot bar. Not. Um. Oh, heck. Way. I need a punch bar. Thank you, much appreciated. Alright, so you go up there, grab your chest, pop it here and here, mine these blocks, pop it here and here. So put your hoppers behind the chest, bang and bang. Absolutely amazing. So, now comes the noisiest part, but in my opinion, the best. Pop this here. So these should start going round and round and round. Like, yes, 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 it's very impressive and all. Also, you can do it with different blocks just to make them spin around. It's very fun. You might want to just take this a little bit away from your base so put your iron ore in here your fuel in here and watch them all light up you can surround this the actual frame of some glass if you want if you're feeling fancy but from that I thought they were lighting up individually but no they're not they're just being pushed around uh-huh and you see, the, the iron has already been distributed. But it hasn't been all smelted yet. So it should take around two rounds to fully smelt the iron. Yeah, depends. Because if you do this, then each of it gets two. But if you do it at a different angle, say you do it like this angle, each only gets one. That's actually more efficient. Whoops. So yeah, do that. It doesn't really matter with the coal, because I really like coal, apart from me, because coal makes the world die. And so that's, it's pretty fast. It's better if you put more items in, more of a merrier. So pretty, you can, I think you should choose one fuel source, because if you choose more than one, it just c confuses what well, certainly confuses me. So. Twenty-four. But. Okay. Once it stops going around, you'll have your iron. Uh, what? But yeah. That's it. Probably put lots and lots and lots and lots of fuel in there, just so you don't have to ever restock it ever again. But there it is, the full whammy in its all powerful beauty. So, thank you for watching. My name is Chili Pepper Two Thousand Six. I was about to say the my name tag. Thank you for watching. Goodbye.